Uh, if you were lucky enough to get one of the uh, very few uh, invitations to the wedding of Tina Turner, she was marrying her long-term partner here uh, in Switzerland, in Zurich. This is probably where you would have found yourself uh, perhaps afterwards on the way back to where you came from. Perhaps you live overseas. You might have taken a stroll uh, down this rather well-to-do area um, of the city centre. Um, and Oprah Winfrey was one of those able to get one of those invitations, probably one of the most high-profile guests at her wedding. Uh, I'm told that Oprah Winfrey came along this street, did a bit of shopping. She popped into uh, that shop, uh, Mulberry, uh, just over my left shoulder. Uh, it seems that she was after maybe um, a, you know, a handbag. She might have well had one or two uh, Swiss francs spare to spend. And so she made her way along this street into this shop here, Tom Ford. It's owned uh, by a lady called Trudy Goetz. Um, it has one or two very nice items inside. And uh, she appeared to be looking for um, a handbag to buy. The trouble is, when she got there, uh, she was told by the assistant uh, not to look at the very expensive £24,000 handbag uh, on the shelf, but rather she was offered some much cheaper ones instead. This is how Oprah Winfrey describes her exchange uh, when she spoke to Entertainment Tonight. I say to the woman, uh, excuse me, may I, may I see that, that uh, bag right above your head? And she says to me, no, it's too expensive. And I said, no, 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 see, see the black one, the one that's folded over the, the, and she said, no, 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 you don't want to see that one. You want to see this one because that one will cost too much. You will not be able to afford that. And I said, well, no, I really did want to see that one. And she, she, she refused to get it.